there we go. Greetings, everybody. BJ Weller back with you for another wonderful Friday afternoon here, or evening, morning, night, whatever the case may be, for wherever you are in the world. It is October 20th, 2017, day 87 of 100 days of gaming. Yes, it's your schedule and everything else is so jam packed and annoying. Um, this weekend that uh thank you yes and there's taz hosting us thank you very much that um yeah we're just gonna we're just gonna do 100 days of gaming here uh for stronghold kingdoms uh, i've been trying uh, what i've been trying to do is try to get as many different games as possible and not repeat so many games throughout these 100 days as possible but you know hey gotta live with the schedule good evening taz good evening so yes, day 87. I'm just going to use this, uh, the, the 100 days overlay just for our uh, our introductory uh, half here or third or whatever it ends up being. It's probably going to be like uh, a tenth or yeah, half, half, third. I guess it'll be a third or whatever. It'll be a short stream today. We've got uh, Mrs. EB's excusing herself. Uh, grandkids need attention too. Yeah, well, exactly. Yes, we all know how that is. Well, not grandkids, but in my case, just kids, but yeah uh we all know uh real life calls real life calls the way it is so we're probably only going to do about an hour and a half maybe um today depending uh, of course uh what are we doing here why are we doing this uh well we like playing games and it's stronghold kingdoms a, a little fun game here to play by firefly uh, uh a sort of uh mmo rts continuation of their single player games that they uh, created back in the early aughts, the early part of the, uh, or even the, I guess the late part of the 20th century, early part of the 21st century, really, when you think about it. So Stronghold Kingdoms here, our weekly island, island warfare mayhem here for Extra Life, just to, you know, hype up Extra Life and all that stuff. We're, we're two weeks away. In two weeks, we will be doing this. This will be starting uh, a 25-hour marathon gaming session to raise money for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. We've got $285 uh, in the bank for CHOP right now. Every single penny goes to the hospital, goes to helping sick kids get better. So that's why we're doing this. This is why we do this uh, every week, and it just happens to be a, a good day to stream Stronghold Kingdoms as well. So Stronghold Kingdoms and Extra Life, that is no better combination. So that's what we're doing. So day 87, so 14 days to go before we start our Extra Life Marathon. 13 more days of 100 days of gaming to go after this. So 13 more videos. Uh, don't even know what I got lined up. I think I might do some of my simulating reality games. Uh, we already just, in fact, we just did uh, Microsoft Flight Sim X uh, yesterday uh, for day 86. Uh, of course, today we're going to do Stronghold Kingdoms just because uh, the schedule is a little bit tight tonight. Got to stream, so got to try to stream Guild War, at least one more Alunian Adventures episode for Guild Wars. And of course, uh, but uh, it's the American Truck Sim, Euro Truck Sim 1 and 2. Um, bus Driver, I think we'll have coming up uh, in, 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 the, in the coming week here for 100 Days Gang. But anyway, let's get on with it. Let's see where we're at here. Of course, uh, as part of our Stronghold Kingdom's uh, Extra Life theme, uh, our faction here, Knights Hospitaller, Charity Honor, Bravery to Protect All play styles. That's what we're here for. We are uh, a friendly, helpful faction out there to help uh, help the world of the Philippines here that we are playing on. This is the Philipp special Philippines map. It is affected by uh, weather, or at least uh, travel from one island to another is affected uh, by the weather. Right now we've got some pretty good weather here. Strong winds means that inter-island journeys will take a quarter of the usual time. So uh, everything, uh, I guess that's about 75% faster journeys then uh, from one island to other. Now, um, if we're going from uh, one point on an island to another point on the same island, like if I were to go across the bay here, the weather isn't a factor, unfortunately, but... Uh, it is a slightly different mechanic. Um, here we are in Dabio Oriental. We still have uh, Lapu Lapu and Don Mariano Marcus as our parishes uh, that we are steward of. House 17 still in firm control. Don't think there's going to be any change to that whatsoever. Uh, the glory round. 
glory round finally ended. Let's see when it ended. It is day 625 today. So I had better write that down, huh? Day 625. Today in Stronghold Kingdoms. Uh, so when was this? Uh, today. All right. So uh, it actually ended earlier today. Uh, house 17 won this glory round. We are down to two, five houses left. Five houses left. So uh, I think the last glory round was day 569, as I recall. So this is a good uh, 31. 56, 56 days, so pretty much a solid two months worth per glory round. So figure if, if that keeps up, we still got two, four, six, eight more months. Um, realistically speaking, probably about seven. So let's figure seven more months uh, for until age one is over here on this world. And uh, I'll be a sad puppy because I really enjoy age one uh, in Stronghold Kingdoms. Uh, just so you know, look into the uh, SCS blog, the new ET, uh, your truck sim 2 DLC. Ooh, it's coming big, heavy haul. Resized loads with safety vehicles besides as you guys. Ooh, so I know Battery got me, uh, Battery gifted me the, um, the original heavy haul. I think that's what he gifted me for uh, Euro truck 2, um, was the, 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 the heavy haul. So this is a super heavy haul, big heavy haul. Excellent, cool. Yeah, I know I gotta start looking to close the door. Close the door. You have to close the door so the cat doesn't come down. Do you want to come down? Okay, go watch. Go go watch Sleeping Beauty then. <laughs> Open the door. But yeah, so yeah, I, I I've got to look into the DLC of uh, of uh, some of those games. I picked some up for Train Sim. Oh, Train Sim Layer too. We're definitely gonna do that. Um, yep, extra heavy haul. It's not out yet. All right, good. Yeah, I'll look, definitely look at that. But uh, yeah, I think for Train Sim, um, I got. Um, I know there's a couple of uh, DLCs that were um, holiday related, Halloween and Christmas. I think so. I might do. I might see if I can do the, the Halloween mission or whatever it is. I just, it was free, so I figured, hey, download it. But I got to look into more DLC, uh, DLC for all their games and stuff like that. But anyway, yeah, so uh, seven months. So that puts us right around, I would say, right around May. So we're looking for the age change to probably be in May sometime at this point. We are under attack by the wolf. Yes, the wolf has returned to Lapu Lapu again. So let's move on in. If you're coming down, come down. If you're not coming down, you gotta keep the door closed so the cat doesn't come down. Okay, so the wolf is attacking us, so we're gonna take a look at this wolf's castle as soon as we close the door so the cat doesn't get into trouble here. Where's my mic? the show all right there we go she just came down to tell me she has a little bit of a diaper which of course we can't do anything now because i've already started the show and time's wasting so uh let's see so the wolf is attacking us the wolf has returned so what else have we got for you today uh let's check out reports i know we got a couple of new people to welcome into uh the faction so let's get that out of the way straight off Battle Report of the Week, going to be a big Battle Report of the Week. So we might even skip the mid-show and just go right to Battle Report, Battle Report of the Week. Almost because we do actually have a lot of reports to go through today. Uh, attacks on Sayer 05. And of course, we still have uh, attacks on Death Angels from last week to go through as well. Uh, but let's welcome Bug Funny. Bug Funny to uh, the Knights Hospitaller faction. So welcome, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Of course, if you are a Stronghold Kingdoms player and you do play here on Island Warfare, everyone is welcome to join Knights Hospitaller as well. Just go ahead and apply. We have open membership. We are, a again, a peaceful, farming, helpful, uh, friendly faction. Although, as you can see, as you will see from these battle reports, we do fight uh, when the need arises but uh, we primarily farm and uh, help 
other players and all that kind of stuff. So if that's something you're interested in, please come join us. Apply today. So welcome, Bug Funny, Bug Funny. Who else we got here? Uh, Izali. Welcome, Izali, as well. Thank you for joining us. A pleasure, as always, to have new people join us in the faction. Uh, the uh, hello, siege hello, camp hello, is gone, everybody. so things have been... Hi, yep, say hi, everybody. Mm -hmm. So the siege camp is gone, so we don't have to worry about those attacks, at least for the time being. We just have the wolf. And the snake in Don Mariano Marcus. So there's the Wolf's Castle. So again, uh, we're going to be taking a look at uh, both the attacks on Death Angels and the attacks on Sarah 5. We got a, a whole big thing I have to uh, um, go through here now. Okay, so good. All right, so we'll do that. That's something for the marathon. I'm working out with Taz here, but let me bring up um, let me bring up the information for Taz. That way, I have it all ready for me when we go into those reports. Good. So, oh, dang it, I didn't want to do that. Uh, but yeah, that's that's pretty much it. So we do have the wolf who has attacked us, and we did attack the wolf again. So this wolf, the wolf castle, just keeps on popping up, popping up. We do a scan report of the wolf. Uh, recent, very good, excellent. Taz says hi. By the way. Yeah, Twitch act. Yeah, Twitch is. Yeah, Twitch has been acting up like nuts. Between Twitch and YouTube, it's it's just been nothing but a headache this past week and a half. I think I'm getting an ulcer from both of them. So I can see already that um, my Twitch view count is still incorrect. So I, uh, with everybody, I can see listed in chat. I should have at least that many people on the view count, and it's still not working. But whatever, Twitch. Whatever. All right, so the wolf has attacked us. We're going to be taking a look at those. And again, I'm um, not sure how much more uh, I got to do here. So we do have some research. Well, I'm re actually, I've been researching now. Um, using my last four points of research uh, is into the captain tactics. Um, at some point, of course, uh, you know, and forward thinking to H2. And, you know, we might end up having to do more fighting um, uh, out of necessity. Uh, certainly want to have to be uh, have my captains able to access these tactics and that kind of stuff. So, our last point research points uh, are going to be going into tactics to max out that little branch. And uh, let's see what else here. Current quests. Let's see. Uh, still all the monk quests, with the exception of course. You want to go upstairs? Or are you going to stay upstairs? Okay, go ahead up. Make sure you close the door behind you. Okay. I can't. No. Oh, I have to open the door. That's right. I have to open the door. All right. We'll be uh, back in a sec here, folks. Oh, and hence why, you know, streaming, <laughs> I, just, I can't catch a break for streaming for, for to save the life of me anyway. So yeah, so we've got all these monkey quests, all these monkey quests, a couple of team player quests. So the quests I did finish I brought up more monkey quests. So at some point, hopefully uh, in the coming weeks, we'll be able to start knocking these out in between shows and stuff like that and get some different quests we can do on the show. Uh, let's see where we're at here. Still marquee, so obviously we have more than enough points probably to make prints at this point. Uh, so I gotta decide when we're gonna rank up. Otherwise, I think we just have some castle repairing to do, and that's um, that's pretty much it. Just to repair some castles. I'm not gonna really do too much work or too much other stuff today. Just again, because uh, we, got, we got, got quite a few reports and stuff to go through, and uh, the time is limited to really. Uh, I'm not even going to run commercials. We're just going to go through the whole show today. And of course, I'll, I'll split it up as usual for YouTube. For anyone who wants to watch the different segments and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, no commercials. I just want to uh, uh, blitz right through everything. Um, 
first things first, uh, let's do this. We'll go hit, uh, clear out some wolf flares here. First things first here, wolf flares. Because we, uh, we are going to need reinforcements for this, um, uh, wolf castle. Regardless of what it is here. Uh, let's pop up from the Don Mariano, so, okay. Don't have anything here now. Somebody did end up attacking the snake that was here in Don Mariano Marcus um, this week. Uh, the report's gone already. It was a couple of days ago, and of course another snake pops up. Uh, we built, uh, threw down another a uh, statue here in uh, the village of Don Mariano Marcus. We don't need to worry about Manila. The poo, the poo. I mean, uh, I mean, we could we could do another statue. If we so desire, six thousand gold, eighteen flags. So we got enough flags. Maybe that. Six thousand gold. Um, sure, why not? Might as well. Might as well. Not really gonna use the flags for anything else at this point. Everything else is built. Everything is built that can be built here in La Poo La Poo. So let's do that. Stash forbridged. Uh, let's take a look at these uh, attacks on us by the wolf. By the wolf. And we will take a look at us attacking the uh, other wolf's castle that popped up here uh, this past week. As well from the one we destroyed last week. Another one in return. But first things first, let's see the wolf attacking us. We'll take a look at those. We'll take a look at us attacking the wolf. And then we'll uh, move on to the next segment of the show. Pelagio. Pelagio. I also have to think about, um, that's probably something I'm going to have to do in the, in, in the coming months as well, is uh, uh, do, do uh, more, more uh, reconstruction here in, in each of my castles. Um, and not just uh, grocers that uh, we've done over the last couple of weeks. Uh, just to make sure we can get all the ballista and all the uh, turrets. Um, that we have available in uh, all the villages because again, once the age change um, The parishes get wiped out and we no longer can build that stuff until we place the buildings and rank them up again, which uh, Is going to take quite a bit of time So we'll probably be talking about uh, doing some team player quests and Ranking up some guild buildings in our parishes um, at this very point in time a year from now in 2018. We'll be, we'll be sitting here trying to decide uh, what uh, buildings we are going to rank up next and what buildings we're going to place in the parish. So yeah, I, I, I did this repair earlier, um, yesterday, yesterday or the day before. I can imagine that might even been this morning. Yeah, because you know, I couldn't log on yesterday. So we still might have some repairs going on in our castle that we uh, implemented from this morning. So good, pillage that we stopped. There, let's head back down here. Where are you? Okay, so that one. Nice bit of honor, but it's just, nonetheless, it's just... Look at Pillage here. This looks like, is this park yet? I don't know, I don't know, no, I don't think there's a park here. This is, uh, this should, oh, this is Vacation Cabin is what this one is.
One thing I might test too with uh, with the captain. Um, uh, well, that's why I would test it just to see because you can place the captain um, as a defender in your castle. Um, I just don't recall. I just don't recall if you have access to the tactics, to his tactics as a defender, if you can set something up and then when the attack happens, so use it for the I'd like to try to spend with arrow volley, arrow volley and see if that works or not. I'll have to think, we'll have to play around and test it at some point. Throw a captain in one of our castles and see what happens. That is the one disadvantage, you know, the one thing I think, or not disadvantage, but the I think I think the one advantage is prob probably the only advantage um, that I I found from being the only person uh, in your parish and only having one village in your parish. You only have one village in your parish. And you're the only one in your parish uh, from USA two was that it was very, very rare that the wolf would appear um, in the parish. In fact, it'd be rare if a pig would appear. It's mostly, usually, either the rat or a snake, even if you're a prince or crown prince. Well, at least prince. I only made prince on USA 2. I only got as high as prince before I stopped playing on USA 2. Uh, but, you know, and, and you know, if you watch some of those videos, it's one of those things that I continue to, to harp on a bit about how how tough it is to build up a parish if you are the only one in there and you only have one village in that parish. Um, but again, the, I think the only advantage to that is that it makes the AI weaker when they spawn in that parish. So good we stopped that one as well. So of course with everybody here uh, in Lapu Lapu, uh, well, here's Don Mariano. So we're, we're definitely getting a snake here with, with me having two villages and Taz here with his one village. So uh, the rat occasionally looks like the snake will be normal. But again, with everybody we have here, the Bri, me, Taz, and Megan, um, it's more or less going to be a wolf or nothing here. And we'll do the food, unfortunately. So I think... I think the south one is the one we destroyed. I gotta let the map update. Yep, okay, so let's send these guys out. Uh, wolfy layers, wolfy layers. Ooh, we lost some more. We lost some more. Pike in here. So let me write this down and make things easier when I do the uh, descriptions and highlights here. Uh, wolf attack us. New members. Wolf lairs, the usual wolf lairs. Now what I need to do before I, we look at the next wolf attack on us, I need to find myself a, um, I need to find myself a bandit camp around here somewhere. See the closest one? Oh, no, okay, we got a couple down there, good. Gotta try to go, uh, move up in the rankings here. So even though they're out of honor range, I need to, uh, I want to hit bandit camps uh, regularly every day. Uh, as a matter of fact, let's take a look at our rankings. Let's see where we're at here. Um, so bandit, we, we've actually dropped here. I think we, I was up to 162 at one point. Uh, maybe. But right now, in 164th, so uh, we got, uh, we're a little tight here with the guy behind us in 164th. We got a bit of distance before we can uh, move up to uh move up a spot here we've got uh about 60 bandits we need to uh kill here and the last couple of bandit camps i did hit were very small so they didn't really help in that regard wolf slayers slowly uh slowly moving up we're still hanging in here uh oh, we're 63 uh by herself now so whoever somebody else had 63,000 this morning so they uh they must have moved up a bit here uh, but uh, sitting sitting by ourselves with 63,000 wolves here uh, in 123rd. Of course, this is going to move up now because uh, it hasn't updated yet with the wolf layers we are hitting now. Uh, but as you can see, it's quite a, quite a bit of jump now. It's going to be uh, we've been moving up the ranks quite quickly the last couple of weeks. 
Um, but now there's there's a bit of distance now. There's a bit of spread between each of the positions here now. As a matter of fact, between here, so so just the eight spots ahead of me, there is a ten thousand wolf uh, difference here. So uh, that's a lot of wolves. I've got to kill over four thousand wolves just to break the top one twenty now at this point. So a lot more wolf layers we're going to have to hit. So we're going to have to keep hitting them quite, quite often here. The wolf attacked us again, so we'll take a look at that. So let's take a look now. Let's finish taking a look at the wolf attacking us here. Take a look at the ones I haven't even looked at yet to see whether it's a ransack or a pillager or what have you. So let's take a look at this. Second, you do no special powers of the captain one in defense. Ah, okay. Yeah, it's been interesting. Yeah, I didn't. Yeah, I wouldn't think so because unless, of course, you know, um, you have the option to do it, and then because I, I know that you know we have a couple of cards that add in, like a, a, the ability to repair uh, when being attacked. Um, you know, the sal the extra sally forth, that kind of stuff. So it would have been interesting if we were able to use you know Captain's tactics uh, for defense, but. Thank you, Detach, who already tested it out for us. Saves us the trouble. Trying to think, we've got about an hour now. So let's see, we're almost a half hour into it. Do 30 minute segments because yeah, it's only going to be about an hour and a half stream today. Unfortunately, I like to I like to keep my streams at least a minimum of two hours. Um, but again, with with the viewer count being wrong, uh, not being um, not being correct, uh, doesn't really matter, I guess, at this point. Because usually, the longer the stream, the more chance you have of people uh, popping in to to see uh, through, uh, as the stream uh, is going here. All right, so uh, he actually did manage to uh, ransack us, or yeah, ransack us, pillage us this time, but minimal stuff here, not too bad. Just the damage, the damage is the pain in the butt here. Okay, so we've got that one. Let's take a look at this one. Uh, Discord to look at this. We'll take a look at that. Another pillage on this side. Boy, look at that. It's been a long week and it's, well, it ain't over yet. So I still got this weekend I got to get through. Oh. Oh, and I think uh, we have a meteor shower to try to look at tonight, too. Oh, the Nerd Stash. Hello, Nerd Stash. Thank you for the host. Thank you for the host, Nerd Stash. Give a shout out to Nerd Star. Hello, Twitch Keaton. Oh, Super Mario. Uh -huh. we got this? So I do want to grab a screenshot of this chat here again for. Uh, we do have just Taz right now in the chat. Who signed in anyway? Of course, uh, if somebody's not logged in to Twitch, they won't show up in the viewer list. But regardless, I got some of my mods and my regulars here in the viewer list, so uh, no reason why they oughtn't to be showing up here. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that now. Yeah, look at that. The viewer can't finally popped up. How amazing is that? Ha <laughs> ha. At least something worked for a change. I think it, I think that came from that host too. So welcome everybody who's watching from uh, the Nerd Stash channel. Thank you. Oh, 
oh, oh, oh, oh. Let's, uh, let's mute that. We don't need to, uh, there we go. There we go. All right, good. All right, so, uh, we stopped that pillage. And we've got, uh, is this it? Yep, this is the last attack to take a look at here. All pillages, okay. This this one will probably end up stopping too, but let's see what damage we got here. Then we'll uh, review my attacking the wolf and then we'll move on to the next segment. That sounds good to me. Of course, this is from the new, uh, the, the last uh, couple of attacks we watched here. Uh, I've been from the current Wolf's Castle. The, the first couple were from the, uh, I think, the older Wolf's Castle. The water of the wolf. Jeez. Well, here's something I, I'm probably going to want to do then. Because this keeps happening regularly. Is that those, um... Those barracks keep getting dinged at catapults. So we're gonna have to move them deeper into the castle here. Oh, Jesus. There's a number on this one. I mean, I'm also gonna throw some ballista out here, too. Alright, let's, um... Let's finish out here, because I do want to move on here. So we did defend, which I figured we would by lane. Okay. Yeah, so we're gonna, we're gonna do some work on our castles here in the next segment. Now for shizzles. Okay, so let's uh, take a look at us attacking the second Walder Wolf's castle uh, to appear in La Pou La Pou in the last uh, week or so. And then uh, we'll see if we can hit the um, new Wolf's castle we'll take a look at here. So I did shift over my archers here a little bit. Okay. There we go. Still haven't quite gotten them right on top of the tunnel yet. So I'm gonna have to make a slight adjustment again to uh, the formation of those guys back there. I to, or I move them to the left. I probably should move them to the right. Okay. Broken through, so it's just a matter of getting through here now. I'm gonna do this. Let's see if we can mark that to see how this is going to work. Alright, we got in there. We got in there. Very good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So another water wolf goes down the turlet. Nice bit of honor. Lost, uh, lost 30% of our catapults. Uh, just less than half our pikemen. And the majority of our archers. But uh, again, that's typical for that wolf there. Okay, so let's do this. Um, let's take a look at this wolf castle. Oh, that's not good. We don't have a report of him, do we? So this is a nasty guy here. Definitely not a water wolf. Um, so let me do this. I do, 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 do. Let's do this. Um, so I don't even know if it's going to be worth me getting a report. So this is where this guy is at. So let's bring water wolf out formation here. Okay. So good. All right, we've got these guys here. So I can't move my thumb. Let's uh, hold on now, fellas. Come on, select, please. There we go. So we want these guys to be right there. Pretty much that puts them right over the tunnel. All right, so we're going to save this formation. Water, wolf. So the formation, yes, we do want to override it. Of course, that's not... Oh, you know what I just did? Because we don't have enough people. Too late! 
Yeah, too late, Taz, too late. <laughs> I forgot because I don't have enough troops in here. Suffering succotash. <laughs> All right, well, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to redo the formation. Or we're gonna have to reset everything up once we um get the troops uh, we need back here in um Oh, poo, poo, poo. So we're not going to be able to attack the wolf anyway because we are so low on troops anyway. Um, yeah, we're going to have to re, uh, redo the formation. Ah, that's right. We'll do it again. I should, You know what? I should have saved it as a two. Should have saved it as water wolf two. <laughs> Too late now. All right. That's right. We're going to hit some more wolf flares here. And uh, we're going to move on to our next segment here. Let's send this army to I will uh, kill archer, archers first tomorrow. Okay, so good, good, good. So we'll save the wolf uh, attacking this wolf, uh, the report for that for next week. In the meantime, let's see here. Wolf's attack stopped by diplomacy. Wonderful. Thank you for diplomacy. Uh, let's see what we got here. Yeah, losing some archers, but uh, killing the wolves there. So that'll help us move up the ranks here. Oh, teeny guy, teeny tiny guy. All right, this bandit camp. Oh, good. Okay, it wasn't minimal, but uh, small, but uh, gave us a little bit of bandits to hit here. So let's uh, move up here. Uh, let's scout this guy. And one thing I did notice, too, um, I remember pointing out that House 3 had... Uh, this guy from House 3 seemed to appear. Mario223, that I recognize the name, but I don't remember where from. Now, it looks like he took over San... Isidro this past week. Uh, so I don't know if anything else is going to come of that. From House 17. And then this guy. There's somebody down here. Oops. One of these parishes was neutral too this week. Um, looks like uh, whoever it was. Oh, it might have been this guy. He's now in House... House 19. He had taken over Mapuli before he was in a house. In the looks of it. Alright, so let's, uh, I'll send the scouts out to this and we're going to move on to our next segment. Here.